hot plus 19 degrees from 299 Queen Street West. This is Toronto's breaking news, CP24. Good morning, I'm Carmen Wong. And we start with some breaking news. The OPP have issued an amber alert. We are live to Stephanie Smythe at the breaking news death with the very latest. Stephanie. This is an amber alert. Thanks, Carmen. And after disappearing yesterday, the Amber Alert issued this morning for Matthew Zhang by the OPP at the request of Peel Regional Police. Matthew was dropped off with his mother yesterday morning at about 10 a.m. at an address on Mississauga Valley Boulevard to visit his mom, Wei Chen. When the father went to pick him up, uh, he was not turned over by the mother. And it's believed that the mother has now fled the area. So they are looking right now, police, for a 2005 gray Honda Accord license plate AVAM00. That's a gray Honda Accord license plate AVAM009. Wei Chen does not have custody of Matthew, and police say she's not able to care for him properly. Let's go now to uh, Cam Woolley. He is at Peel Police Headquarters this morning. And Cam, uh, tell us why Peel decided to escalate this to an Amber Alert after all these hours. Uh, certainly, Stephanie, and these investigations are always very fluid. And just on my way here to Peel headquarters, I did see the Ember Alert signs electronically appear on Highway 407 just before I exited here, here on Ontario Street. Constable Fiona Tivieres is here. Uh, Constable, you had a, a press release that went out uh, overnight saying the youngster was missing and now an Ember Alert. Uh, why the difference in time from the first press release to an Ember Alert uh, very recently? Well, when we first uh, received information that the boy was missing, um, Matthew has been uh, missing before. His mother has ha had him on a visitation and has not returned him at the time she, she was supposed to return him. But it's never been um, contacted. Police have never been contacted before. He's always been returned within a time that his father felt was, I guess, appropriate. Um, yesterday, uh, he was not. It was he, the mother was no longer there when the father went to pick him up and the vehicle was missing and the boy was missing so the father at that point contacted Peel Police and we began an investigation and as you said these investigations are, are fluid and they change all the time so yesterday based on uh, the history with with the mother there was no immediate concern for the I mean there was a concern for him but not uh, for anything in, imminent um, investigation through the night and uh, situations that have come up overnight have changed that course of the investigation and we now feel the boy uh, is at risk and that's why we've requested the Amber Alert. What's going on right now as we speak with Peel Police and other police services across Ontario and the public? Well, right now, because the Amber Alert is out, we had uh, Twitter and um, news releases going out anyway with uh, looking for the license plate and the grey Honda um, that the female was driving. So obviously investigators would have um, have already contacted border control services and the airports and that type of thing to make sure that the female has not crossed any borders, and as of right now, she has not. Um, so we would be monitoring her bank accounts and her cell phone and that type of thing, as well as uh, all police services across North America would be aware that um, this this person is missing and has been abducted by their mother and the um, sorry the uh I drew a blank there. That's all right. um, and uh, obviously, citizens also, because it's now out on the highways, that gives citizens the uh, the ability to recognize the vehicle more quickly. They may forget the license number, and then they're driving, they see it again. So we are really heavily weighing on citizens to contact police, call nine one one if they see the vehicle. Don't approach the vehicle, um, not because she's you know going to hurt you or anything, but just because um, we don't want her to flee. So it's better to call 911 and has a, have an officer attend and deal with her themselves. Thanks very much, Constable Tavares. Now, if you do see him, uh, remember, you it's the one time you can dial 911 when you're driving, if you can do it safely. Back to you, staff. Okay, thanks, uh, Cam. And over now to Carmen. Thank you. Uh, following confirmation on Friday, Brendan Shanahan is being introduced as the president of the Toronto Maple Leafs at the